the huge V6 engine into the front of the car gives another challenge in terms of the cooling performance, getting air into the vehicle, making sure that we can retain all of the performance and the durability of the engine when it's in its new installation. The GTR engine was 480 horsepower, which should make an incredible Duke car. How are we going to fit the GTR engine in the Duke? Well, we start off with a jig uh, that sets all the positions, but then it's a case of removing the bulkhead, offering up the engine, and then fabricating around it. The main issues with the GTR, aside from the size, is in heat management. It gets very hot, it's a very powerful engine, and therefore it rejects a lot of heat. We're studying the standard GTR and trying to utilize as much of that technology as possible. Well, the cooling we're going to be very careful with. We've studied the front package of the GTR and we're ensuring that the body kit on the Ducar will have enough openings to replicate that cooling. And we're also going to transfer the entire package, the cooling cassette, if you like, from the GTR into the Ducar to maintain that level of performance. Now the power plant is in place, we've got to transfer that power to the wheels. The next task is to fit the gearbox and drivetrain.